2022 marks the 15th anniversary of the Kansas City Wabash Cannonball. The event has grown from an idea to a staple amongst the K-State community. When I think back 16 years ago, the K-State Alumni Association had a vision to create a signature event in Kansas City. Meeting with Carl and Joel Gerlach made that all possible. Amy at the very first meeting said, make it a fun event, make it something that's memorable, but more importantly, get as many K-State people together as possible, because that's our goal. It's that family that, <coughs> excuse me, that means don't something cry. to me. Huh? Don't cry. <laughs> <laughs> I am going to cry. I'll cry if I want to. One of the things that I think is so motivating for a lot of us was that what we were doing was creating an endowment that would really create a change forever. That initial committee, they were given a challenge. There's a lot of competition out there. We want K-State to be at the top of somebody's list. If you just said in that first year that we'd be over $3 million in endowment funds, that's crazy. We never do that. I mean, that's impossible. But we did it. It's been a wonderful way to make sure that the best and the brightest from Kansas City have the tools to go to Kansas State and experience what we experience right. there. But let's be clear, if it's not for the vision of that inaugural committee, encouraged by the Alumni Association, Bob and Ann Rainier involved with that and many others, we don't get to stand on their shoulders and be where we are 15 years later.